Watching these girls in practice last week, they look like the best of friends. But now on the rink, mortal enemies. The rules are there's five girls on the track at a time, and uh, one is the jammer on each team. The blockers from both teams skate around the track in a pack. And as the jammer passes each girl, and the pack of girls skating ahead of her, she gains a point. Um, you can't score a point if they push you out of bounds. You can use anything from your elbows, between your elbows and your knees. You can't trip, you can't grab, but you can like elbow people and you can knock people down. Like That's all fair. It looks really chaotic at first, but once you realize the rules and you understand the positions, um, you recognize the strategy. It's very, very competitive. We're all very nervous. We're at the Bank of America Center at Kennedy Plaza in the heart of downtown Providence. And um, this is Providence Roller Derby's second bout. There's two teams. It's the, uh, the Mob Squad and the Sakonet River Rats. We're the Swank and they're the Skank. My derby name, more importantly, is De Silva Bullet. Uh, my last name is De Silva, so you know, makes sense. There's a certain amount of, of theatrics that that lends itself well to the sport. Is it real and as opposed to fake? It's totally real. It's a full contact sport. I think anything you have to wear a mouth guard is a full contact sport, is a real sport. Sometimes it gets more physical. Sometimes there will be days where everyone's just really frustrated, and then like there's a lot more like fighting. Fights happen because you're pissed off. Like I only take girls down when they've crossed me. I definitely don't think it's us like prancing around like being cute. We're like respectable athletes. The more you play, the more brutal it gets. You definitely take a lot of falls. You really take a beating. I've never played sports before in high school. I always kind of wanted to. I always wanted to play a sport, but I could never find a sport that I could really enjoy. I've done a lot of, of different sports. Definitely, hands down, the most fun. You know, the camaraderie is like unbeatable. They're all really easy going. Um, they're all, I mean, they're all really dedicated. If I could get paid for this, this would be my full-time job. We're very committed, like two mandatory, three, you know, practices every week, and the practices are two hours each, usually. We all have full-time jobs and uh, do this on the side as a hobby, but it ends up occupying, you know, upwards of 30 hours a week sometimes, because we're just really dedicated to it. You know, we do it because we love it. We're athletes and we're serious about this and we want to be respected as athletes and giving credit for that and giving credit for what we do and not just cute little girls wearing roller skates and in short skirts. One more jam to be fair. Attractive. And we are more We're better attractive. dancers. <laughs> There's probably at least um, two dozen other leagues around the country. Some people want to get it into the Olympics. Some people want to get roller derby into the Olympics. 
I, I would love to start a business in, in this and do it for the rest of my life. We spend so much time at practice and like going to practice and organizing that we've become really close pretty fast. We love it, it's so much fun. Just a great thing to be a part of.